Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Dr. Beth Vettil. I'm a musculoskeletal radiologist. My aim is to simplify and discuss research papers in medicine so everyone can understand and benefit from scientific research. Today, let's talk about a landmark paper in musculoskeletal radiology, Patterns of Migration of the Femoral Head in Osteoarthritis of the Hip, Radiographic Pathologic Correlation, and Comparison with Rheumatoid Arthritis. This paper was published in the American Journal of Radiology in 1975 and is authored by Dr. Donald Resnick. So let's first talk about the hip joint. The hip joint is a ball and socket joint connecting the femur or thigh bone to the acetabulum, which is part of the pelvis. Two of the most common causes of pain in the hip joint are osteoarthritis and rheumatoid arthritis. Osteoarthritis or degenerative arthritis is when you have loss of cartilage and joint destruction due to wear and tear, which can be uh, due to old age or overuse. In comparison, rheumatoid arthritis is when you have an inflammatory destruction of the joint, usually due to autoimmune causes. The treatment and prognosis for osteoarthritis are quite different from those uh, for rheumatoid arthritis. So it's very important to know what kind of arthritis is affecting someone. This paper talks about uh, how you can easily differentiate osteoarthritis and rheumatoid arthritis just based on the x-ray findings. So based on the pattern, the femur head migrates. So in osteoarthritis, the femur head migrates supralaterally or medially, whereas in rheumatoid arthritis, the femur head migrates axially or concentrically. This paper brings attention to the simple yet effective detail to understand the cause of joint destruction. I hope this episode helps you all understand and appreciate this scientific paper. I have posted a link to this paper below. If you all have any questions about this paper or any other scientific papers, please let me know in the comments below. Goodbye.